In this lesson, we'll learn to solve linear equations with one variable and multiple steps. You know, solving an equation means finding the value of an unknown variable by isolating it. To isolate a variable to one side of an equation, we use inverse operations based on the operations performed on the variable. The inverse operations are applied in the reverse order as the original ones applied on the variable. For example, to solve the equation 2x plus 4 equals 10, you see that 2 is multiplied to the variable, then 4 is added. So first we undo the addition. The inverse of addition is subtraction, so subtract 4 from both sides. Since 4 minus 4 is 0, these cancel, and you get 2x equals 6. Now divide by 2, which is the inverse of multiplication. Since 2 over 2 is 1, these cancel, and you get x equals 3, the solution to the problem. Now that you've reviewed solving equations, let's look at more complex equations. Some equations can be simplified by combining terms before you solve them. Remember, like terms have the same variable or variable product. The coefficient may or may not be the same, and constants are always like terms. Look at the equation 3x plus x minus 3 equals 2 plus 8. Here, 3x and x are like terms. To combine like terms, add or subtract the coefficients according to the sign, and you retain the same variable part as the two originals. Remember, x means 1x. Since 3x plus x is 4x, you have 4x minus 3 equals 2 plus 8. Similarly, 2 and 8, which are constants, are like terms. Since 2 plus 8 is 10, we now have 4x minus 3 equals 10. Now solve. The x is first multiplied by 4, then 3 is subtracted. You undo these in reverse. Add 3 to both sides to undo subtraction. This gives you 4x equals 13. Now undo multiplication by dividing by 4, which gives x equals 13 over 4, the solution to the problem. Now that you've learned to simplify and solve more complex equations, let's try another problem. This one's a little more interesting. It has variable terms on both sides. 3y plus 5 equals 7y plus 2. Since there are variable terms on both sides, you first need to bring them to one side. Subtract 3y from both sides, which gives on the left 3y minus y, which is 0, so the y term goes away. On the right, the new y term is 7y minus 3y equals 4y, which leaves you with 5 equals 4y plus 2. Now you have only one y term, which looks much more familiar. Now subtract 2 from both sides to undo the addition to 4y. 2 minus 2 is 0, so you can leave it off. And you are left with 3 equals 4y. Now divide by 4 on both sides to undo the multiplication of y by 4. You get y equals 3 over 4, your final solution to the problem. And you've done it. You've just solved a linear equation with multiple steps.